hopefully this would work. And I want to make more devices tomorrow. And this also runs on batteries. So that means it's like a phone, but you need a charger. You need a charger to run this. But anyways, Daniel was our best worker here, so he will help out a lot. But tomorrow, he would have to go back down to get some resources for the science lab. But okay, we can do that. Let's send a message to Daniel. Hi Daniel, this is your boss at the science hospital lad. Would you like to do an experiment with me? And okay, it's sent. Let's do this. Well, that's when I started to... Hold up. I'm sorry, someone texted me. It's my boss. He said if I can do an experiment with him. I'll reply him back saying, okay, sure. I'd love to do an experiment with you, but on one condition. Daniel, this is really good. Can I please join the experiment too? Sure, but I need to talk to see if he can let you. Is it fine if my girlfriend can join the experiment too? And he said yes. Yes, okay, that's good. But who will take care of the kids? I'm pretty sure that they can take care of themselves because the eldest child have here. Overall, he's about 16 years old already. And he can help with the house, do the laundry, clean the house, walk the dog. Daniel, we don't have a dog. Oh yeah, so I thought, I forgot, we didn't have a dog. I used to have a dog a long time ago. But anyways, we start tomorrow morning, okay? Jenna, we are leaving now. Wait, I'll do it later. Make sure to take care of themselves before you leave. Yeah, okay. Let's go now, we don't have long. Okay, wait here, Jenna. Follow me inside. Jenna, meet my boss. This is my boss, Dr. Wilbur. Hi. Daniel, you here? I'm assuming that you have Jenna with you. Well, yes, I do. Jenna, this is my boss, Dr. Wilbur. Hi, Dr. Wilbur. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. So, what we are planning here is a time machine. I'm assuming Daniel has told you that already. He did. Okay, so, we are using this device as our time machine. Now, we only have three of these left, and we need to be really careful about using these. They are really expensive and super hard to make. Only take one. Okay. Now, what year do you want to go to first? I don't know. Any ideas, Jenna? Um, 2024. That's the year we met each other. Okay, Dr. Wilbur, we have chosen that we want to go to the year 2024. Okay, so select the time to 12 a.m. and put the date that you want to put on. That will set the time to what time you travel to. And lastly, click the red button and you will time travel. But be careful on the other side, it will be dangerous. Okay, can we do it now? Yes, let's do this. Three, two, one, go! <sighs> Whoa, where are we? Daniel, we are in 2024. Oh crap, I forgot. 2024 was really dangerous that year. Do you know what it was? <sighs> nothing. Literally, literally nothing. Okay, so what's it today? What's the date? It says here, 25th of August, 2024. So, we did time travel. Hmm, okay, so we should start moving. Where should we go? Daniel, do you own a car in this year we are on? I do have a car, but it's a two-seater. Uh, Dr. Wilbur, is it fine if you go by yourself and Jenna and I can do it by each other? Sure, you two can go by yourselves. Thanks, okay, so Jenna, you know what the date is, right? So, I have a car, and we can use that car to go anywhere. Well, okay, so you can get your car, right? Uh, no, I can't. We're not. 
It's all the way in Brookhaven. Well, where are we then? Trano Gaming Movies, Brookhaven Cinematic Country. So we are about 5,000 miles away from Brookhaven. So we can book a plane ticket to Brookhaven. Uh, sure, we can do that. Okay, follow me and be careful of the road. There are a lot of cars here. I'm hungry. Can we please eat? Uh, sure. I can smell the food here, too. I'm hungry, too. Let's go. Hi, can I please have some, uh... Uh, hi, what can I get you? But I don't know anything, but I get what she gets. Okay, please take a seat, sir. What would you like, ma'am? Can I please have some chicken wings? Sure, please take a seat. Your order will be served in your table. How is this going so far? Are you nervous right now? Uh, no, not really. I feel really fine. Well, okay. I'm just checking to see if you are okay. Also, Jenna, I need to talk about something. What is it? Whilst time traveling about the past, never talk about the future. Bad things can happen. But Daniel, what happens if you talk about the future in the past? No one knows. It's just really dangerous. Finally. Here you go. Dinner served. Here are the wings you ordered. Uh, thank you. Also, Jenna, you do not want to know. It can cause violence. Okay, sure. Uh, thank you for telling me. Anyways, I wonder how Dr. Wilbur is going. Hi, uh, can I please have a bubblegum ice cream? Sure, I can get you that. One bubblegum ice cream. Here you go. Here you go. Thank you. I need to talk about Daniel and Jenna and see what they're getting out to. Well, I need to call them. Hello? Daniel, where are you? Um, Doctor, um, this is not Brookhaven. We're in the Brookhaven. The training game Brookhaven is in the magic universe. Okay, no. This is really weird. Whoa, 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 whoa. Slow down. What happened? Wait, so this isn't the Brookhaven? This is the training game is in the magic Brookhaven in the universe or something? Okay, but can we get a ticket to Brookhaven? Okay, thank you for telling me. Sorry, I have to go. Okay, so we're here. We need to get a ticket. Three of those tickets. Okay, let's go. Hello, welcome to the Brookhaven Airport. Verification IDs, please. And what flight are you going to? Uh, all three of us are going to Brookhaven. So, flight 5482 will be called out soon. Place your bags here and I'll be ready in a minute. Thank you. Can flight 5482 hop into the plane right now? Have a wonderful flight to Brookhaven. Okay, thank you. Oh, this is nice. Everyone, welcome to flight 5482. We'll be flying to Brookhaven. It is a far trip there, so we will expect to be there in 16 hours. Well, enjoy your flight. Hello, what would you like in this flight? Nah, I'm okay. I already had something. Well, same here. Um, a packet of biscuits, please. Sure, coming up. I wonder how the kids are going at home. I mean, what are they doing? I'm starting to get worried about them too. You do realize we can time travel anytime and nothing can do anything. Besides, we were only gone for four hours. We got this. 
But yeah, but what are they really doing? Tim, I'm hungry. When are we gonna eat? Oh, come on, it's fine. I can order takeout. Thank you, big bro, you're the best. Tim is gonna order takeout. Well, what is Tim gonna get us? Mm, just wait, Anna. Let me talk to Tim first. Tim, what are we going to have for takeout? Jake, we could probably get some Starbucks on the way. I mean, but no coffee for both of you, since you're too young for it. But you're too young, too. Okay, but anyway, do you know how to drive? Well, I don't know, but I could try. We can use this car. Wait, 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 wait. No, nah, are you seriously using Grandpa's 1960s car right now? I mean, isn't... Wait, he could get angry if we do this. It doesn't matter. Let's just get some Starbucks. What the heck? Did I just see a 14-year-old drive a car by himself with no guide? Actually, madam, I'm a 16 years old. I can actually drive. And you do realize I can drive cars if I want to now, so... Okay, but anyways, what can I get for you? One meal that will bring three people to a set. Sure, that's $87.53. Try finding my car. It could be here somewhere. Keep finding it. Okay, but where can it be? Where can your car be? Wait, look over there. I, what is it? Oh my God, is, it, it can't be. It's, it's, is, is that me? No way, that isn't me. It is, let's follow them. What is this? Oh, these lights are so annoying. Okay, I'm going to get rid of them soon. Okay, Daniel, but this is getting weird. There's no way 18-year-old you can be in this timeline. Hello, what would you like? I can't believe this. This is weird AF. Well, there's some crap happening. Like, what the hell is this? Damn, damn it. Don't give a crack that up. Ah, you know what? I'll just go. Sir, you ordered the pancakes. You can't go yet. I ordered you, you paid it, and you can't waste your money on food. Why do I curse so much in this timeline? What have I even done? Yeah, that's it. Um, Jenna, there's a problem I found. Well, what is it then? Why do I swear so much in this timeline? Sounds like a you problem to me. Are you kidding me right now? Bzzz. Wait, sorry. Hello? Dr. Wilbur, I found 18-year-old me. I'm in the past. Well, tell me then. Well, I can't. But yes, doctor, I do know. So, what did you do? There's one thing we need to do first. Then what is it then? Tell me right now or I will... Okay, chill, chill, chill. We need to capture him and see if he's the real me. Are you kidding me? Capture your 18-year-old corpse? Dang it, Dr. Wilbur, we need a van. My God, God. Damn it, you! Slow. I told you, Daniel. You have bad no no language habit. Very bad, Daniel. Should. It? Oh my gosh. Okay, okay, I'll get the van now. No. Oh, what a relief. Why? Wait. Look over there. What is it? I think I found my car. Just. It's behind you. Where? Is that it? Is that your car? Well, it has to be. Why don't we go over there and check it out? Follow me. Wait, Daniel, check the license plate if it's really your car. I mean, we could be stealing. Okay, I'll check. Yes. Train of 1111. See, it's my car. It's literally my own car. Can you see it? Let's just drive it.
Daniel, that's a bad idea. You should never steal cars. You cannot commit Grand Theft Auto. A wise man once told me this. Sussy cow. Okay, Jenna, where to? What do you mean, where to? You just stole a car. Okay, but we can return it once we come back to that 18-year-old midget. You're talking about yourself. But he will get mad. Well, I, I, it doesn't matter. He won't care. Besides, I did fail my driving test at 18. So, why would he care? And besides, I couldn't drive that back then. What are you doing? Well, hold on to your soul. We'll go really fast. No! Hey. No! Ouch! Sorry, I didn't mean to do that. But... Daniel, no wonder why you failed your driving test. But 25 years later, you still dressed. Oh my gosh. Why would you do this? Why would you even bother driving? 21 years later, you don't even know how to drive. Oh my gosh. No, 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 no. Ow. Ah. Oh my gosh. Why? Look what you did, Daniel. God damn you. Oh, sorry, Jenna. Hopefully you didn't get hurt. You, you made me hurt. I broke my egg.